everyone and welcome to my channel. I'm so happy to have you here. I am Summer, a homeschooling mama to one little and we are currently in our third year of homeschooling. On this channel you'll find videos about books that we love as a family or books that I just love as a person, homeschool encouragement, and resources that are inclusive and affordable that we like to use and we want to share. So stick around. So today I'm going to be sharing with you a free math resource I have found on the internet. It's from a nonprofit organization known as the Math Learning Center, and it's created a resource known as the Bridges in Mathematics curriculum that I'll be sharing today. This curriculum is geared towards pre-K to fifth graders. However, this is not the only resources um, or services that they offer on this site. MLC, um, as they're known for short, they offer a wide range of free lessons and publications and they have case studies and other information to back up their research that they've used for um, the curriculum that they've created. They service a lot of educators throughout the United States as well as um, many educators in international locations as well. So on this page, you will see a brief description of what Bridges in Mathematics curriculum is, who it's geared towards, and that it is comprised of three distinct but integrated components, which are problems and investigations, workplaces, and number corner. It'll just give you a brief description of what to expect with the curriculum. So as you can see, this is the page with the free lessons and publications that the company offers. Some of these are geared towards specific grade levels and also specific subtopics within the uh, math subject. So you have like algebra, uh, visual discrimination, you have breakout activities. And we are actually going to do a flip through of these practice books or one of the practice books that you see right here. But you can always go back to this page and find out what resources and activities would best fit the needs of your child. You'll see the Bridges practice books that we're going to do a flip through of. These books are filled with activities and worksheets for additional skill review and also assessment like preparations. Each volume also includes answer keys and a complete listing of the student pages grouped by skills. You can use this as a supplement for any math program or you can use it as a standalone as well, especially if it's for like kindergarten and like first grade levels. You'll notice that they have two versions, one in English and also one in Spanish. So let's jump into it. So you'll notice that there is a introduction page um, for teachers and also this is the table of contents. Here you can see uh, what each season, they do it by like a seasonal theme, um, what will be taught in each chapter and each section. So you have time, you have um, sorting, counting, measuring, shapes. So you can go ahead and look at what they have here. On the introduction page, you'll see that they reference 72 black lines in this document. So it's basically 72 lessons within the workbook. It'll show you what the key skills are that they'll be learning. And if you'll notice on top of each practice page, there's going to be a small text about when you should use this page with, you know, along the lines of use after session four and uh, session five and whatnot. However, if you are just using this book as you know, just a practice book for another curriculum or as a standalone, then you don't need to worry about those session texts. They're for use if you're using a specific curriculum from the Bridges program itself. So other than that, you can just go ahead and look at the these pages that outline the skills that each section will address. So it shows recommended timing and that's what that's what it's for. Um, that's the reference that they're going to use for the Bridges Kindergarten program itself. So you can just go ahead and disregard that if you're not using that program. So we're going to go ahead and just show you a quick overview of what the book looks like itself.
that was a quick flip through of what to expect from a practice book from Bridges in Mathematics. And most of the workbooks follow this format as well. You'll go ahead and see in the description box below, I'll have a link to the MLC page with the practice books. You know, if you need other free resources or affordable math resources, go ahead and head over to my blog, which I'll also link below in the description box. And I have a list of some of the free or affordable math resources that we've either used or we've heard good reviews about. If you like content like this, go ahead and like you know, hit the like button, go ahead and subscribe. And thank you so much for your time as always. And that's all I've got for you. So aloha, ahoy ho, until we meet again.